This is a faux leather recliner that a friend gave to me. My son has taken it to college, so my goal is to make it look better and to extend its life. To do this, I'm going to patch the damaged areas using a self-adhesive leather repair patch. I purchased this one on Amazon. This product works on leather, faux leather, vinyl, and other fabrics. There are several sizes to choose from, as well as colors. Pre-measure the damage on the chair in order to know what size roll to purchase. Then, pick the closest color to match the chair. The roll came with easy to read instructions. I will be following these instructions in the order they are given. Begin by using a rag to wipe away any debris or dust from the surface. Be extra thorough on the areas that will be receiving the patches. Then take a pair of scissors and trim any loose edges around the damaged areas. Once all edges have been trimmed, apply some rubbing alcohol to a rag and wipe the areas that will receive the patch. Begin measuring all the areas that need to be covered and write the dimensions down for each piece. Keep in mind the size of the patch will need to reach beyond the edges of the damaged area. Also, for aesthetic reasons, it's a good idea to make the patch big enough so it's symmetrical with the chair. Then, unroll the patch material with the backing paper facing up. Measure and mark the size needed for each patch. Cut out the pieces using scissors, or use a utility knife as seen here. Continue this process until all the pieces have been cut out. Decide where you want to begin and select that piece. Position the piece where the backing is facing up. Then, peel up an inch or two of the backing along the starting edge and fold over in this manner. Next, adhere this edge at the predetermined location adjacent to the damage. Expose the non-adhesive side and smooth the patch along this edge, pressing and manipulating it into place. Then, peel some more backing from the adhesive side and smooth it by using a clean soft rag as you move along. I find that an old sock works very well when smoothing the patch. By taking your time and with plenty of manipulation, the wrinkles can be mostly smoothed out. In this case, I'm patching a chair that has a lot of wrinkles in its character, so I'm not too worried about getting all of them out. In other words, I want it to match the rest of the chair. Once satisfied with the placement and looks, use a hairdryer to warm it. This will help bond the adhesive to the surface of the chair. Continue patching the other areas in the same manner. I recommend having someone to help clear the way in tight-fitting areas. Another tip is to heavily cover areas that receives the most contact and abuse. Even though the damage on this chair is minimal on the armrest and seat, I will purposely cover the majority of their surface. And as stated previously, I try to keep all placement of material symmetrical in relationship to the chair. So the size patch on the right armrest will be the same size and placement as the one on the left. Finally, 
touch up any areas that need smoothed out by working from the center out. Once finished, the chair can be used immediately.